You don't know Bad man Yeah, yeah, yeah This body baby, oh Ah, this body baby, oh Yeah, yeah It's a bad man thing, yeah, yeah Bad girl make you want to be this, nah, nah Hey guys, as promised in my last video, I'm finally sharing with you guys the pre-pull treatment that I used in my wash day routine. Now this treatment is the bomb when it comes to thickness, moisture, reducing hair loss and all of that good stuff. So you definitely want to keep on watching. Now let's get into making the pre-pull treatment. So the first thing that I use are some Ambunu herbs. I've been in love with Ambunu recently because I just love how it moisturizes my hair and how it feels on my hair as well. Ambunu contains something called saponin which gives it the ability to cleanse and is also an effective antioxidant, anti-inflammatory and also an emollient. It makes our hair softer, it adds a beautiful shine to it, it makes our hair stronger, it gives us thicker hair and it prevents dry scalp and lessens hair loss. Super super amazing so I added two tablespoons of that. Now the next ingredient that I'm going in next is some Moringa leaves. Now you can use Moringa powder for this if you want to. Moringa is a powerhouse of nutrients for our hair, it helps to restore the strength of our hair. It also promotes healthy hair growth and helps to repair damage so if you do have damaged hair definitely consider using moringa as well now the final ingredient guys will be some horse tail now horse tail contains something called silica and this is known to stimulate hair growth it also helps to rejuvenate the hair by adding a really nice shine to the, to its appearance and also gives our hair strength so it's super super amazing it also contains selenium and cysteines which are known to promote healthy hair growth so for this i'm using one tablespoon now i'm going to go ahead and add some hot water to this and just allow it to infuse now i was just a little bit impatient because I was trying to get everything done as quickly as I could so I did later on decided to just pop this on the stove and allow it to simmer for just a few minutes or until the whole thing started to thicken up a bit so I'm going to show you guys what I mean in a little bit you don't know. Now this is it here simmering away so you can see that the gel has started to form at the top. I must also say guys I'm sorry if you can hear music in the background. My neighbour is playing really loud music as I'm doing this voiceover so please excuse the noise if you can hear it. So essentially after it simmered for about 5 to 6 minutes I took it off and just pop it in the same bowl that I had initially. I'm just going to allow this to cool down before I go ahead and strain it. Um, so I'm just going to cover the um, the bowl with a plate and just allow it to just do its thing really while I do other stuff. So after it's cooled down guys this is what it looks like. So all the herbs have settled at the bottom so we're kind of ready to just go ahead and strain. Um, so for this I will be using a recap but feel free to use any other thing that you may have available. Um, so yeah, it's really simple. Just pour that on there and just give it a gentle squeeze just to get everything out and then that's pretty much it. Now what makes this treatment even more amazing is the fact that I'm going to add some really really amazing oils to this. So I'm going to start off with, with using castor oil. Now castor oil is super super great. Great moisturizer and also guys it does help a lot with thickening your hair. So super amazing. So I added one tablespoon of that. Now this is my hose, um, hibiscus and rosemary infused high of oil that I have available on my website so I'm also using it in my DIYs and also on my hair on my daughter's hair um, so this oil has been infusing for such a long time and it smells super super amazing and it's super good as well at stimulating hair growth and helping you guys to regrow this the, the, the hair that you may have lost in certain areas so it is super super amazing so i will be adding just a little bit of that a little goes a really long way just like i said 
is it contains rosemary essential oils and also hibiscus and it's been infusing for quite some time so this is actually really really good um, now after adding the oils guys I'm going in with some honey honey is a natural humectant so this draws moisture from the atmosphere into your hair and it's super super amazing to have in a pre treatment or any type of treatment that you do to your hair because it will help you a lot with moisture and now because i was planning to use this as a pre treatment i needed all the moisture that i could essentially because shampooing dries your hair out now if you use ingredients that are super moisturizing for pre pouring it really helps a lot so this is such an amazing treatment that you can add to your regimen so mix the whole thing together and now we're going to go ahead and pop this in our um, applicator bottle just because it will be easier to use obviously not all of it is going to fit in this applicator bottle so i'm going to go ahead and put the rest in a little jar and then i will transfer it um, after i finish using the one in the applicator bottle later on yeah 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 on me yeah no escaping from my mind but low key you know that you one of a kind wanna show me baby so this is it here guys really nice and ready so we're just going to go ahead and apply this to our hair now if you made it to this point of the video and you still haven't given it a thumbs up please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up it really helps my videos out now let's hop into the application process now if you've watched my watch day routine video that i posted yesterday you would have seen this part already so i guess you can probably skip if you want to um but obviously if you didn't see that video which i know some of you guys didn't get to watch it um then carry on watching because obviously i'll tell you um how to use it and also you can get to see basically how my hair reacts to this so um yeah just keep on watching so um, just like I said, I posted a wash day routine video yesterday and I used this treatment as a pre pool treatment. Um, so that's basically the same click that I will be using in today's video. So for this, essentially, I parted my hair into four sections just to make the process a bit quicker for myself. And I essentially just worked this through my scalp and also throughout my hair including the ends as well now you don't necessarily have to use it only as a pre treatment in case you don't know what pre means um, it just means that it's a treatment that you do before you shampoo your hair and that essentially helps you to preserve as much moisture in your hair as possible and also your scalp natural oils which normally shampooing does strip your hair off essentially um, so like I said you don't necessarily have to use it only as a people treatment you could also use this just as a regular hair growth treatment that you do perhaps once every week just to help you with moisture and also because this contains amazing ingredients that are known to help stimulate the follicles to promote healthy hair growth this could also be used for hair growth in that way um, essentially as a leave-in conditioner so essentially you just moisturize your hair with it apply it to your scalp just like you're seeing me do here and style your hair as you would normally but instead of shampooing your hair afterwards do not shampoo essentially so you just leave it in and this will help you a lot when it comes to moisture and also when it comes to stimulating high growth especially in areas that you suffer from thinning or perhaps that you may have lost hair from now look at how my hair has been transformed like it's crazy from that dry crusty hair that i had initially to this super super moisturized hair it's, it's just it's just amazing and i'll show you guys later on as well what my hair looks like after i shampooed it so essentially i just applied it throughout my whole hair and then i'm going to put a plastic bag on my hair just to allow it to um to have heat essentially and then i'm going to go ahead and shampoo my hair Let me 
Fashionably late on purpose, all eyes on you. So fashionably late. Wind up on the place, not all of the guys want you. Shut it down. Now let me know if you're going to try this or if you've tried this before. Um, let me know in the comment section down below what you think of it. And then yeah, that's kind of like pretty much it. If you have any questions, don't forget to leave them in the comment section down below. I do try my best to read and answer all of them. I mean, not answer straight away, but I will always answer them. So this is my hair after shampooing, guys. You can see it is super soft, right? super soft super amazing and I, that's why i really really love this treatment and i hope that you guys go ahead and try this out so this is it for me today thank you so much for watching don't forget to thumbs up the video also subscribe to the channel guys if you're not already all the ingredients will be linked in my description box and i'll catch you next time bye